Hello everybody and welcome to another edition of Drew's Food Reviews and today I've got another episode of Classic Candy Corner. Um, found these at my local grocery store. Now I know you can get a whole lot of different ones in a lot of different places. Um, candy shops, mostly you get them by the pound, pick and choose. Um, online, um, used to have them like, you know, I, some of the stores still have them in bins, but this one I happen to find in a bag. They had different um, kind of mixes of them, and this is uh, State Fair saltwater taffy. They got all kinds of different flavors, all kinds of different uh, patterns and stuff, and so this is by um, Sweets, State Fair, Taffy. Uh, and this one was an interesting because it's got um, bubble gum, cotton candy, butter, popcorn, and red licorice flavored. And they have all kinds of different ones. They have banana, chocolate, watermelon, uh, and some of them have really elaborate patterns to them. And I know you can like pick and choose. And normally you go like to the regular candy store, they'd have barrels of them. And you'd like, you know, pick a scoop of each one and get the different flavors. Um, yeah, and there were some of them were really out, outrageous, like banana split, um, orange cream, uh, yeah, chocolate, vanilla. Uh, cherry, chocolate covered cherries, it just, it, you know, all kinds of different weird flavors. Um, buttered popcorn, <laughs> cotton candy, red licorice, and popcorn. So, I don't know. Then they had the ones that were sour. It was a little different one, but I thought these would be kind of cool to try. Go back to the old classic days. A lot of times if you would go, we have a place up here called uh, Santa Cruz Beach Boardwalk. And also Atlantic City, you know, you go to the to the pier and you'd uh, go to the candy store and they'd have the saltwater taffy and they'd have the, you know, fudge and um, things like that. And, uh, yeah, these are very chewy. <laughs> they tear up your teeth. Look at this, it's the bubble gum, the uh, buttered popcorn. I think this is cotton candy. I have red licorice in here. See, because you know, in the back, it's got uh, buttered popcorn, cotton candy, red licorice, and bubble gum. And all the ones in here are pink flavor. And I don't know, they just didn't include, either they didn't include it or uh, I don't know. But I'm not gonna sweat it. Try the different flavors for you guys. Right, so this is the, the, apparently this is pink bubble gum. And I think it's gonna taste a lot like the pink bubble gum. I know I used to get these um, when you go to the regular candy stores. Had them in the barrel, you bought them by the pound, half pound. All right. Very chewy. Oh, yeah. That tastes amazingly like bubble gum. Mm hmm. Pink bubble gum. Real strong flavor. Um, most of the most of the most of the flavors really did taste a lot like whatever it was supposed to be. Very strong flavor. I don't know. They made them in house. They pulled them. Seems like they had all kinds of coffee, black licorice, um, <laughs> tutti frutti, banana. I like banana and watermelon, peach, vanilla, strawberry. They even had like cookies and cream and some really real wild and exotic ones. Oh, it comes not too bad. A lot of chewing. <laughs> Um, all right, this one's going to be, I believe it'll be cotton candy. Hmm. Maybe they were out of red licorice flavor that day. I don't know. Sometimes it doesn't always get in the mix. Okay, that's not quite as hard. That's a little softer. Sometimes they'd sit for a while. They get a little bit tough. Kind of. Oh yeah. 
cotton candy, right? Right away. Kind of sweet. Um, I think the, the f color of the cotton candy was different. Pink one was just like sweet. Bubble gummy cotton candy. The, the blue one was like just sugar. They had yellow too. What I'd like to find, which I can't find anymore, is the pink popcorn. Those were cool. Normally you get them at like a fair or carnivals, midways. They would have them as you uh, went to the little stands, a hot dog on a stick, lemonade, that kind of thing. Pink popcorn is in a little brick. I don't know if they make them anymore. Seems like you used to get them candy stores, some of the amusement parks, theme parks have them, but there was always, candy store always had a unique assortment of saltwater taffy. <laughs> wow. That one tastes like popcorn. Even a little bit of salt, saltiness to it. <laughs> hmm. Weird. Because you think you should have the regular popcorn flavor, but. Okay, I remember going to um, candy stores, boardwalks, amusement parks, they always had like a candy store, and then they had all kinds of cool stuff. One place I used to remember was I used to go up on the way to Reno or Tahoe. There was a place up there called Sam's Club. Or Sam's Place. And it was an old time general store. It was really cool. They had the best candy in there. Jawbreakers, like different sized jawbreakers. Saltwater taffy. Um, things you can get by the pound chocolate covered carries, stuff like that. Um, just lots of different things to choose from. And the old style things, yeah, like um, Boston baked beans. Some of those ones you can get them by the pound now. They don't, they don't, um, they don't do that much anymore. And the place, Sam's Place actually closed down a while back. It was really cool too, because they had like a arcade in there video games, skee-ball, air hockey. Um, every time when I would go up there, I'd stop on the way up there. And then they had, it was like an old time saloon type thing. They had a restaurant and all that cool candy, candy store, general store. And it was fun to go visit and um, check out somewhere. Um, maybe if I could find it, I had an old picture of um, me out in front of there when I was a little and they had a cart from the Planet of the Apes that uh, Charlton Heston was in. It was like a movie prop. And it was always fun to stop there at the old general store <laughs> and getting, yeah, jawbreakers, saltwater taffy. Those little, um, the candy sticks that were all the different flavors that they had in the jars. You know, all the peppermint and uh, licorice and banana and all those ones. I did a review on those before. They were like little straight candy canes, but they had a whole bunch of different ones and they were like a penny a piece. And remember those. And then old time candy too, the candy buttons, chocolate coins, all the old stuff out there. Those were always fun to go into those old time candy stores, general stores. And they had things in the barrels, you can get them by the pound. All the fun stuff, gumballs. <laughs> yeah, gumball. Come on, machine. So they were always fun to, to check out. So, anyways, um, there you go. A little bit of uh, memory with saltwater taffy. And like I said, you can still find it in lots of stores, um, candy stores online. You buy them by the pound. Some of them are sorted. Some of them are pretty cool with all the different uh, flavors they come up with. Um, just a big variety. 
and it was kind of always my uh, one of my favorite I like that one so yeah every once in a while get a little bit of taffy and have it but you got to be careful because it's very sticky and it'll mess your teeth up and don't get it too often but when I do get it once in a while it is kind of fun and like I said this one was uh, not too bad except for apparently there's no red licorice in here but you don't know that unless you actually went through there so anyways there you go a little bit of fun with saltwater taffy so if you like the video give it a thumbs up don't forget to hit the subscribe and the notification bell over here that way you won't miss any future content or if i go live you won't miss the fun so until next time on drew's food reviews when i'll be trying something classic for you um i'll be on the lookout for more classic candies to give it a try for you so until next time guys I'll talk to you later.